Hi, welcome back to Paul's Rule of Thumb. Uh, we're gonna do an Aldi haul here for you. Um, a lot of this stuff is stuff that I've shown you before, but I did pick up a few new items today as well, and some stuff from the uh, Isle of Death, as our friend Michael calls it. It's the, the random items aisle. But you know, sometimes you find some good stuff in there. So um, yeah, I just thought I'd go do a quick run through, show you what we got, and uh, see what you think. So, the first thing I got that was a special buy um, that they don't always have is the Cherry Berry Blend, which is uh, dark sweet cherries, red tart cherries, blueberries, and strawberries. And these were a special buy, and they were on sale. It's three pounds for $8.99. I grabbed two of those. Uh, those are going to get turned into jam at some point. Um... I grabbed the vanilla unsweetened almond milk, which is a staple here in our house for overnight oats, which I will be putting that recipe together here shortly for you. Uh, turkey pepperoni, I've talked about that before. I love it for snacks, for pizzas. So we got three of those. They had these on the special buy. This is the Kraft olive oil squeezable mayo. Um, I have a couple of these in my pantry already, so I always... Grab a couple when they go on sale because they're a great item to have on hand. Um, I got this. was also in the special value aisle. Uh, let's see if we can back up from it so you can get a better view of it. So Spanish extra virgin olive oil. Um, I think those were $3.99. I've been using those for a while now as they've had them. And they're pretty good. I like how it pours out of the bottle. I know that's silly, but... Sometimes the control that you get when it comes out of the bottle and goes into the pan is important. You can see behind that, I got another container of Old Fashioned Oats. Again, that's for the overnight oatmeal, so we'll be making some of that. I also picked up some protein powder that we use in that recipe. We get that at Aldi as well. They have chocolate and vanilla there. This time we grabbed chocolate. Um, so we got a container of that. Um, let's see. We got a bag of apples, because Josh loves to snack on apples, so just grabbed a three pound bag of apples. This was in the uh, Isle of Death, a uh, three piece strainer set. Um, I use strainers a lot. I don't know about you guys, but uh, I find a lot of uses for them. I guess when I'm taking stuff out of jars that I've canned and those types of things. Um, mm. So this was nice because it's three different sizes, and I think it was $3.99 or something like that. It was pretty cheap. So that was a easy pick. A uh, couple more packages of our favorite coffee. Let me stand this up here for you. It is the German Roasted Mild. Um, I think I've shown you this before. We use it in our Keurig because we use the reusable pods. Um, then we've got, I found these. These were kind of in their sale aisle as well. So the first one, which you focused in here, is minced roasted garlic and i was like hmm i love some roasted garlic and if i don't have to do the work to get it it's worth giving it a shot it was a dollar 99 so you know it's an eight ounce eight point four ounce jar worth checking out and the other one is get you in here minced chili with garlic i don't know why that won't focus it's having a mind of its own today um, again, $1.99, thought it'd be good to try in recipes, a little extra heat. Um, we also picked up the uh, lens, pre-moistened lens cleaning wipes. We have these in our cars, we have them at work, we have them in our house. We both wear glasses, we use these constantly. And they're $2.99 a box for 100 wipes. Yeah, well worth the buy. Uh, loaf of 12 grain bread. We grab that almost every time we're there. We got a dozen eggs. They were 98 cents today. I really prefer 59 cents, but hey, you know, still under a dollar, so it's okay. And then the thing that we buy every time we go to Aldi is the V. I'll see right where the handle is. Here, we'll show you on this side. V by Bell Grapefruit Sparkling Water. Zero calories, sodium free unsweetened love it so this is the aldi haul for today all totaled spent 95 dollars um so some stuff for the pantry some stuff that we're going to use right away some stuff for future projects um 
Oh, you know what? I just saw a couple things I missed. We got a balsamic glaze. Again, just nice to have on the shelf. And then another jar of balsamic vinegar uh, because I used one up when I made the sweet onion jam. All right, now we're really at the end. Um, again, some of the stuff you've already seen, some of the stuff is new. Just thought I'd bring you along, show you what we, one of the things that we did today. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, if you did, please like, share, and subscribe. And as always, I hope you had a great day.